Hey pretty girls, it's All Things Pretty, and I'm coming to you with a haul video from Tuesday morning. I got a chance to get out yesterday for a little bit and just see what was going on at Tuesday morning. I was expecting that they had some, a lot of Tim Holtz items on sale. I didn't find too much at my Tuesday morning, but I did find a few other random items that I'd been looking for. This Bow Bunny film tape. And this is what it looks like. And it's adhesive for you to put like in your journals or on cards. And I just thought it was really, really cool. So it'll look nice in your planner. So I got that. I was hoping there was more on the roll. I also got these magnets. Um, if you watched my craft room tour video, which I'll try to remember to link in the description box below or above in this frame, um, there was a paint holder that I turned and flipped on the wall and I'm going to use it to hold documents or things that I'm using for sewing and patterns. And I thought these magnets would be cute to hold my items. Bible journaling stickers. And I thought that was a good price because you get different types of stickers in this pack. And then these are, I believe, either clear stickers or rub-ons. So $1.99 I thought was a great price. And there. I get this package. I tried to get one of each kind that I was able to find. And there. And then the last ones are rub ons. I really like rub ons, and they're hard to find, at least the kind that I like. So I thought these were pretty. Jute, which I thought would be great for packaging. Um, Happy Mail or things from my Oh My Elefunkel shop. I just like the colors. Normally you just find like the naturals. So I thought it was pretty for these all to be in the same packet. At this journal block on other videos for your traveler's notebooks. I liked that it had the ruler here so that you could line up where you wanted to place things or stamp things in your journal. Or you could also um, tear your paper to create wavy edges. So I figured I'd try that out. I'm in love with this stamp and I automatically started thinking about all the holiday things that I could create with this. It says cold hands, warm hearts. And it's a really big stamp, the size of my hand. So I thought this would make really cute holiday cards. Or you could stamp it out and cut it out with your, your silhouette or Scan and Cut or Cricut, whatever you want it to do. Scale it down and um, cut out a coffee mug, scale it down and put this as um, a decoration on the mug for a card. So many cute ideas. So I found that Spellbinders. They also had, um, I guess, additional 25% off clearance. And I've seen these, but I've always just walked by them. So I figured I'd give them a try. They're a acrylic soft gel paint. So let's see if I can swatch it out a bit. I don't want to get too much. Ooh. Love that. And it's real soft and smooth. I love the way in which it glides on. I wish they had more colors. I think they had limited colors. I think the only other color that I didn't get was green and only because it was like a neon green and I didn't really care for it. Let's see. And then the last one. Yeah, 
Yeah, they're really pretty. And when they dry, they kind of dry with a matte, soft velvet look. Really pretty. These were 25% off, so I paid like 59 cents for these. Opaque acrylic soft gel in a solid color. Create backgrounds or paint designs for paper crafting journals and mixed media projects. Dries to a velvety smooth satin finish. So yeah, it's by Plaid. If you see these in your store, they really apply nicely. Really pretty. I think they would look great in a journal. So yeah, that's my mini haul from Tuesday morning. Thank you all for tuning in while I have my morning cup of coffee. And I hope to be back to you with some more videos. Thanks for watching.